Hi, this is Steve. Welcome back to Scale Model Kit Review. And in this video, I'll be featuring Eagle Moss's Back to the Future DeLorean. This is issue number 28. So if you haven't subscribed to my channel already, please subscribe. And if you like this video, hit the like. Let's get started. Welcome back. Here's the magazine for issue 28, where you can build the iconic 80s time machine in 1/8 scale. So we go to the table of contents. First thing they start off with drive time, which is our assembly instructions, and then the next thing is what the papers said and the time traveler's guide. Give us a list of all the parts that are included with this issue and how to subscribe. I put a link in the description below if you'd like to subscribe to this. Eagle Moss would be more than happy to get your subscription started. Usually comes in monthly installments of four issues. And this time we get to continue to assemble the radiator for the DeLorean. So it looks like we're actually going to continue with that and we're going to install it on the chassis. Then we get into the first article here is what the paper said and this is uh, more press reviews of Back to the Future from its re initial release in July 1985. And lastly Mr. Strickland, right, the principal Strickland played by James Tolkien. So there's an article about him on that. Then they give us a preview of what's next, which is the chassis, part of the chassis we received in issue 29. So with that, let me get the parts out, we'll get a closer look, and we'll get it started. Here's the parts for issue 28, which is more radiator parts, and I'll take these out. We will go ahead and get a closer look and talk about them. I'll be right back. Here are the parts for issue 28. We get the grill back. We get the grill front, and we get the radiator mount. Plus we get AP screws and FP screws. Step one, we put the two halves together. So turn this over, and it only goes in one way, just like that. Next we'll mount the radiator onto the shroud, and that simply slides in like that, and like that. Now you want to make sure that these mounts here on top correlate with the single exit on this side and the two on that side. And we're going to put our FP screws into this. Two of them get mounted on the back side here. And one more on this side. And there you go. Mounted on the shroud. Looks good. I'll be right back. Step four, we mount the fans to the radiator. And there's six screws that have to go into this once it's mounted up there. Those are AP screws. Simply just lines up to the fan, to the radiator. And we will get one of the screws started. Just like that. And I'll get the other five in. I'll be right back. And all six screws are installed. And that's how that looks. Now we mount this to the front of the chassis. And the last two steps, step five and six, we actually mount the radiator and fans to the front of the chassis. 
and you'll see here's the mounting points, the mounting holes, and then on the bottom of the radiator we have two small holes that the screws will go into. It's simply going to go on top of that, just like that. So we'll have to uh, turn this over and then we'll put our screws in. Okay, so we've got it turned over now and we simply just line our screws up, screw holes, put our FP screw in, and there we go. Both of those screws are in. Looks good. I'll be right back. And that's all we do for issue 28. We uh, put together the radiator and fan assembly, then we put the, the radiator right on the front of the chassis. So that was a lot of fun. It's really starting to come through. I really enjoyed it. So if you haven't done so already, please subscribe to the Back to the Future DeLorean. I put a link in the description below. And if you're new to my channel, please subscribe to my channel, hit the like, and hit the bell for upload notifications. With that, happy modeling everybody. Take care.